A Kiti State joined the rest of the world to celebrate World Teachers Day. Speaking at the event, the Kiti State Governor Abiodun Oyebanji reiterated his administration's dedication to enhancing the welfare of teachers in the state. The governor, who was represented by his deputy, Monisha De Afuye, stressed the resolve of his administration to stamp out examination malpractices in whatever form in order to maintain the integrity of educational sector in the state. Teachers who emerged best in different categories during this year's Teachers Day celebration were presented a total of 47.8 million naira as gift in Adoekiti, the state capital. Also speaking, the chairman of the Nigerian Union of Teachers, NUT, in Ekiti, Daodu, commended Governor Oyebanji for his positive contributions to strengthen the sector, urging the government to initiate policies that will checkmate brain drain in education and retain the best brains within the system. Meanwhile, the chairman of the Academic Staff Union of Secondary School, Shola Adigun, urged the government to enable secondary school teachers advance to grade level 17 for better career progression. We have fulfilled our promise to address this issue career progression for teachers in primary school by approving their advancement from grade level 15 to level 16. I want to assure you that we will continue to play our part for improved welfare packages for all the categories of teachers in the state public sectors. I therefore appeal to, to continue to do your best to give our students the best they deserve in learning. I urge you to remain committed to the human capital development agenda of this administration. So what we are saying now, uh, teachers should not be only should not be seen as the implementer of policies, education policy alone. Teachers should be seen as courageous enough, knowledgeable enough to contribute when these policies are being made. At the formative level of policies, at the formative level of curriculum, teachers should be involved. Sometimes last year, the government of Bekiti State recruited some teachers to fill some vacancies. But see here, excuse me, but see, we still have some vacancies in our various schools. We are pleading with the government of Bekiti State that more teachers should be recruited so as to fill this uh, system vacancy so that this work will be able, uh, teachers will be able to perform more and more. Over thousands and thousands of teachers have been trained and retrained, even in, in digital teaching and the rest. He has put up a lot of infrastructure in the United States for the pupils, for the students, to have a very good environment of learning. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.